Hi, this is a demonstration of the MYOB integration with Shoebox. This is a two-step process where the first step you would import the chart of account from MYOB, then you will export the receipts from Shoebox to MYOB. From MYOB, you will export them by clicking on Export Data Account and Account Information. Then you will choose all the default settings, click on Match All and Export. That will save a file that is called account.txt. You'll save that on, on your desktop. Then go to Shoebox in the Receipt section, click on Manage Categories. The first thing you want to do is to hide the default categories. And indeed, you're going to use the MYOB one, so you don't need this one. So click here and untick the tick box there. Now you want to go to the bottom of this page called Accounting Categories. From there, you will choose the import from MYOB and choose the file we saved just before, Accounts. Then simply click on import and all your chart of account will be imported. What you want to do now is code and export your receipt. Here is one way to do that. The first thing you select your receipt and then choose the category you want to assign them to. At this stage, it's going to ask you if you want to create a rule for these particular vendors to always apply to this category. So this is what I've done here. Then I will export them. So I'll click on export receipts and I will be led to a page called export expenses. From there, I will choose the MYOB file type, then the correct date format. Then I can I have this choice to export directly or to click on verify and send. So I'll click there. That will give me the opportunity to check all my codes and the warnings. When I'm happy, I'm clicking on finish export. When you click on finish export, this is going to download a file on your computer. This is actually a zip file that you can see called here textcompany2.zip. This zip file contains three files. There is a readme file giving you instruction, receipts and vendor file. So what you want to do, it's very important to extract that zip file wherever you like, let's say to your desktop for example. The last step happens in MYOB. You're going to import your vendors, import data card and supplier card. You will choose the default settings. Click on continue, find your vendor.txt file and match the call last name. That's all you need to do. Click on import. You will get an import status of your suppliers there. The next step would be to import the receipts. So to do that, you'll go into File, Data, Purchasing, Miscellaneous Procedures. You'll choose the default. Then you will find your file, which is called receipts.txt, and open. And at this stage, what you're going to do is match all the fields that you have on the left-hand side, date, call, last name, description, amount, tax, association account number, GST code, and GST amount. When you're done, you click on import. That's all you have to do. You will see the status there. and click OK. You can then check your results in the command sentence. Go to Purchase Register and look at all your transaction. You will see all the receipts exported there. This is the end of the presentation. Thank you very much for your attention.